Working with our partners at Passport Publications, we decided to engage and support a local artist, Mr. Kyle Lux, who's created something very Palm Beach and very spectacular for our cover guide this year. I am Kyle Lux. I am a fine artist here in West Palm Beach, and I specialize in portraits of athletes, musicians, cultural icons, and historical figures. I knew this was my destiny as a kid. I was the kid in class who drew all the time, not paying attention. I was still a good student, but I, I had all the support from my family. My mom has a fine art degree, so she was my around-the-clock art teacher. When every kid was getting one hour of art per week, I was getting it nonstop. Born and raised in St. Louis, and family's there, so I, I'm the only one that flew the coop. Uh, but I am pleasantly surprised at the community here and how um, getting in with different groups, the chamber, other organizations, has really propelled my, my, my part here in just less than three years. Yeah, I didn't expect it to happen that quickly. Well, it's always an honor to be considered for, for covers of any sort. Being fairly new to the area, I, I'm still learning the names, especially if you're outside of the Kennedys and Meisner and uh, Flagler. It's like, okay, I'm still learning about who the other players are. So it was really fun to have you and Doug approach me to tell me about Truman Capote and his swans and these ladies in the 50s and 60s and 70s that just ran this town uh, as socialites and philanthropists. I'd say women set the tone for sure. And so I enjoy the research phase a lot, uh, especially with someone like Jackie that has a really deep story. So learning about these women and scouring the internet for photographs, I took different parts of their facial features to create a new face. So it wasn't a single woman that'd be recognizable like my Jackie Kennedy series, uh, but this woman represents Bay Paley and CZ Guest and the others that just were so well known and have a legacy and they have heirs and um, they're still recognized in this town and I wanted to continue their story and, and bring it all together. It's very hard to say you're an artist when most people don't know successful artists. They ask, well what else do you do? What's your day job? What's your real job? That's a hard thing to hear as a young artist physically young or just starting out, maybe in your 60s, people tend to not take you seriously. So you know, battling that as well, uh, but it, it all works out. It's just, it takes a while. So to be patient, have confidence, and uh, enjoy the ride. <laughs>